Let's go over exciting news for the new Star Wars movie currently in the works. This is Mike Zero here. If you guys are new to the channel, do make sure to subscribe to see future Star Wars content. Now, as you all know, the future of this franchise is very expansive. We have tons of anthology films currently in the works, as well as Ryan Johnson's trilogy and the D&D trilogy. And we also have a handful of both live action and animated TV series to come on Disney's streaming service. Now, look Looking at one of the projects that will be held by James Mangold, who will be writing and directing what is said to be the Boba Fett film, we actually do have a couple of new details about this movie. Though a release date is not clear as of right now, the script is to begin later this year of 2018. So we can most likely expect this movie to release, I would say, 2021. The Obi-Wan Kenobi movie is actually said to start its script later this summer and filming will begin in April of 2019 and we're gonna have a blast seeing Hugh McGregor return for the role of Obi-Wan Kenobi. But looking at the Boba Fett film, it won't only be centered on the character of Boba Fett and the movie will be the first in the Star Wars franchise to focus on only the antagonist. Pretty interesting for sure. Now it's said to mirror Rogue One a Star Wars story except based in the criminal underworld. So if this movie is supposed to mirror Rogue One in a sense, could these characters, which I assume to be a group of bounty hunters alongside Boba Fett, maybe they're trying to retrieve or steal something from a crime syndicate that they are going up against, and that in itself could very well be a mirror to a group of people stealing the Death Star plans in Rogue One. Now what I liked about Rogue One was the group of characters that we got. Now a lot of people actually will disagree with me on this. There are a lot of people that feel that, you know, the characters weren't too great in Rogue One. And I can really see, you know, some of your points on that with some of the different characters in that movie. Me, my favorite was Baze. Um, I really did like, you know, the character that was portrayed by, of course, you know, no other than Jin Erso, portrayed by Felicity Jones. I thought she was pretty good in that movie. But nothing beats, in my opinion, Amelia Clark in Solo A Star Wars Story. I feel like she did a far better job than Jin. She just seemed to have more character in herself. Now, looking at everything what happened in Rogue One and looking at Solo A Star Wars Story, the Boba Fett film most likely will be considered the fourth anthology film, with the Obi-Wan Kenobi movie being the third one. So the fact that this movie is going to mirror Rogue One in a sense, to me, I think that makes it more appealing. The fact that it's going to be a movie not just centered on Boba Fett, which when I heard about this news not too long ago, about two weeks ago, when I heard that there was going to be a Boba Fett movie coming, I kept thinking to myself, how could they do an entire movie on the character of Boba Fett? Now, yes, it's good to keep this character mysterious. It's good to keep this character essentially under wraps of, you know, exactly how he came out to be. But I think that the fact that this movie is going to be more of an origin story of the character and how he got involved, you know, in everything that he is involved in with in the original trilogy, I think that's an interesting dynamic for sure. So James Mangold, I think he's the right guy to be the head of this whole entire project. He directed Logan, which was a great film, guys. If you guys haven't seen it, go ahead and check it out. He did an excellent job on the movie Logan. As you could tell, though, if you guys go ahead and check that movie out, it's more of a drama film mixed with some action in there. And I can really see the elements of that movie that could very well be transferred over to the Boba Fett movie. We see this concept of a group of people in that movie, so they could very well do the same exact thing with the Boba Fett movie, which, like I say, it's not going to just be a Boba Fett film. So, <laughs> it really does make one wonder, what could the title be for this movie? Is it going to be Fett, a Star Wars story? Or could it have something to do with the Mandalorians as a whole? That's another interesting thing for sure. Anyways, guys, drop a comment below. Let me know what you think about this. And if you guys did enjoy the content for today, do make sure to drop a thumbs up on this video to support the channel. I thank you also very much for the kind support, and I'll catch you guys next time.